What is post-traumatic stress disorder and how can I tell if I have it or someone else I know has it? What is PTSD? PTSD or, or post-traumatic stress disorder consists of symptoms that people experience when they've gone through traumatic events. What about traffic is so bad? Someone, someone could roll an IED under your car. You're, you're trapped, you can't get out. That happened overseas? Yeah. Yeah, to four of my buddies. It blew them to hell. And I, I saw it happen to two other vehicles. I didn't know the guys, but... God, several times we... We'd be stuck in traffic and people would be staring at us. And I knew that we were going down. Men, women, children, I mean, any one of them could have rolled an IED under us. You look like you're breathing heavily right now just talking about it. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sir. I, I can't help it. As you've seen, the symptoms this man might be experiencing, based on his expressions and body language, are things like shame or guilt, maybe anger and resentment, perhaps experiencing some sort of depression or anxiety. Yeah, it's funny you should ask. Um... Yes, sir. Diesel fuel. I hate smelling diesel fuel. Chopper smells. Um, and last week, uh, Charlie, my, my neighbor, was grilling for Jenna's birthday. And um, oh, he, he singed some hair on his arm. Uh, no injury, but... The smell, um, I had to leave the party pretty fast. As you've seen, this particular individual is demonstrating and showing levels of irritation, agitation, or aggravation. Do you ever dream about these events? Every night, sir. Yeah, it makes me not want to crawl in bed, not close my eyes. So, you have nightmares, you startle easily. Um, are there any other problems that you've noticed? Like what, sir? Um, other cues that cause flashbacks or make you anxious? Um, traffic. Yeah, I, I hate real busy downtown traffic. Um, stopping at a traffic light with people in, in front of you and behind you, on both sides of you, I can't, I can't stand that. Um, I start breaking out in a sweat. I start shaking and, and I can't, I can't catch my breath. As you just saw, he appears just a little more tense. He suffers from terrors or flashbacks. Oftentimes, people have difficulty sleeping. They feel themselves isolating from others. Post-traumatic stress disorder can be severe for those suffering from war traumas or sexual assaults. Symptoms can be less severe depending on how that individual responds to the particular event or trauma. Any person who has gone through an experience that's painful or confusing could possibly be suffering from some form of symptom that has to do with that particular traumatic experience. Even minor symptoms of depression or anxiety could possibly be symptoms related to post-traumatic stress. Often PTSD demonstrates with minor symptoms that may gradually, through time, 
become more severe without some type of support or intervention.